Hey everybody, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whichever it is for you and where you are around the world. Trainer Mike uh, coming to you, or some of you know me as Coach K. Today I'm just going to show you a, an incredible full body workout that you can do in 5, 10 minutes. You could prolong it to make it a half hour or however long you want using one movement and almost no equipment. You really don't need any equipment other than your personal equipment, your body. Okay, so here, here's how it is. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take, I'm gonna take a dumbbell and I'm gonna go in position just like this. Let me, uh, I'm gonna move the camera down for a second. Okay, so sorry about that. All right, so I'm gonna get in position, a squat position. My feet are just under my shoulders, okay? You know, shoulder width apart. They're facing forward. I'm going to basically gonna sit down like a squat in a chair, just as if I had a chair behind me. I'm not gonna lean forward like this. I'm not gonna be leaning back on my heels, but I'm just gonna stay straight, tight over my feet. Basically, my weight is going right into my heels, and I'm coming back up. But what I'm going to add for a full body work load, I'm gonna add a little bit of resistance, and I'm gonna have a dumbbell right here. So I start right here with one, in one hand, I go down to the ground, I touch, I come up, and I press. So I am doing a squat, a curl, and a shoulder press all in one. Also, I'm working my core. I gotta keep my abs and my low back tight, and I'm working my deltoids or my shoulders, also my tricep, my quads, my hamstrings, my glutes, and my calves all at once. Then I switch and I go to the other side. And again, I'm not bouncing. It's a nice fluid, easy movement. And I'm also getting cardio, as you see. So I'm doing 10 reps each side. You can do five reps, 10 reps. Heck, you could even go to 20 reps, okay? I just wanna even it out here and show you that if you do not have dumbbells or if you're just beginning, you just do it with your body weight. You can simply go down and press. Heck, you could even replicate it with nothing in your hands and switch sides. You can go with a three pound dumbbell. That's what I have my six year old daughter using, okay? As you can see, and switch. You can do it doubles. Actually, you can even do it with a, a jug of some sort. This is our laundry detergent. Make sure the cap is on. <laughs> Make sure the cap is tight, okay? And you can use that. Hey, you can do doubles with a basic bouncy ball. Okay, you can use a medicine ball if you have one. And you can even just use a football or a basketball for that matter. Okay, you see I'm breathing, I'm working, I'm getting cardio, I'm getting full body, and I'm getting a good solid workout. Now, if you can do that and go through three sets or four sets of 10 repetitions, or like I said, even just do it for time. Do, you know, come, if you're doing it both hands, if you're doing it like this, you can go for, let's say 30 seconds, or then maybe move up to 45 seconds, then maybe move up to a minute, and do maybe, you know, five one minute routines with a one minute break in between, that's 10 minutes and you're done. Then you can do some jogging in place, you can do some jumping jacks, you can do some jump rope or what have you and finish off your incredible workout. Don't forget to stretch. Always keep your body and your mind in the same alignment when you're working out so you don't wanna have distractions. Maybe a little bit of music, that's fine. Maybe a workout partner, but you don't wanna have other distractions going on because you want your body to be focused and your mind to be focused at the same time. Okay, that's my little workout for today. I hope you enjoy it. Make sure you log your hours. Um, make sure you, uh, like you say, log your workouts and um, come back for uh, some more quick workouts from trainer Mike, Coach K. Okay, I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day.